Hey guys, awesome day today. It's about 28 degrees, nice and cold. On my way to the clinic, uh, and uh, just wanted to share some good mindset, uh, just way of thinking. Things that uh, you know. This morning I had a, we have a Bible study every Friday morning with my my buddies, my Godwad crew, and after we do that, we do a workout of the day. It's what we call Godwad. We get a little God and then a little bit of Wad in uh, every Friday morning, and uh, it's always good stuff, and I always have great things uh, from it. But I wanted to share what we talked about today, just a real quick concept that we can't that, that you know was talked about you know one of the guys in in the group uh had brought something up at the end just very personal i won't talk about who it is or anything but very personal and um just talking about you know and he always has this and we all have this so i'm not but he brought it up so i'm, a, I'm bringing his story up that when he always has in the back of his mind when he's going to talk with someone or even just when he's sharing in the group or anything is before he even does anything just this am i really good enough like what does it really matter what i have to say does it really matter uh you know i mean like who am i or you know just all these just negative thinking and it we do everybody does this i don't care who you are at some level you do this and this could be for you know if you're doing a, a 21 day challenge or if you're doing trying to lose weight this can all go back to everything we we do in our lives whatever your scenario is and it's whether you're going to work out you know you could say uh, you know I don't want to work out today you know what's the point you know I'm just fat I'm just lazy anyways it's I'm just gonna go back I've tried workouts I've tried diets I've done all these things I'm just going backwards anyways right after these 21 days I'm just gonna go backwards it's what always happens and so we get these scenarios in our brain and they're all and I, and I told him I, uh, when, he, when he was talking I said you know what <clears throat> that's just your life experience that's not truth it's just what you've experienced in life right this is what you've experienced in life. That's it. Our brain, if you really think about it, our brain is just a bunch of experiences. And my little girl, Isabel, was in my lap while we were doing this because she gets up early with me. And I pointed to her and said, you know what? She doesn't have any of that yet, so she doesn't know. And so all of our life experiences add up, and it's really our choice because this, this stuff's going to go on in your head. It's going to happen. You're going to have these negative thoughts, and you're going to have these things and, and, and so there, I guess what I'm getting at here is that it's just your life experiences. It's not, it's, and, and you can say, hey, it's, it's the devil coming in, in me. And yeah, it's all negative. It's, that's fine. However you want to look at it, it's fine. But the truth of the matter is, is it's not who you are. It's okay. We're going to have that, right? Before you do anything, you're going to, anything important, anything important. If you're going to speak the truth about something to somebody, if you're going to tell someone that something they're doing in their life is bad and it's going to hurt them because you love them, but you need to tell them the truth. If you're going to, you know, dive into a a 21 day challenge or reset, if you're going to work on working out, if you're going to jump into a a, a healthcare plan, that's just going to take a lot of money and a lot of time and everything else. And in our mind says, Oh, I did this, something like this. It didn't work. Or I went to a chiropractor before it didn't work. My buddy went to a chiropractor that didn't work. This whole scenario that we put in our mind and the truth is, is all we have to do is show up. When you have these negative thoughts, tell yourself it's okay. Just show up. Just keep doing it because, and I used this scenario. You can see I have this hunting jacket on, this camo jacket. And I love to, I love to deer hunt. That's something I've done since I was a little kid growing up with my dad. And there's so many times I would just go sit in the deer stand, five, six a.m. in the morning, cold as you know what, and freezing, and not see a single thing. Sit there for five hours and see nothing. And I, I've probably seen, gotten more times where I saw nothing than when I actually saw an animal. And I've gone seasons, whole hunting seasons, where I only see one or two deer. And but every opportunity I had and sometimes it was too many opportunities I just found ways to get out there I would go get up and I would do it anyways I would just show up because there was a possibility there is what if I see the biggest deer of my life what if I do see one this time and I get to get it and I slept in and missed it and so that what if even though I could say yeah last week I went and I didn't see anything I'm just gonna sleep in I could use that but because I've watched videos of somebody getting a big deer or I've seen my dad get a big deer or I got one at one point, whatever it is, my mind can go back to the wins or even somebody else's win to say, you know what, if that happened for them, there's a possibility it could happen for me and I'm gonna show up. So if it's up with weight loss for you, look back at somebody else's story. Maybe you've never lost the weight that you wanted to lose and you've tried everything. Look back at someone else who did and you can evaluate how they did and everything else, but just the fact that they did it means there's a chance that this will be the time that you did it. And that's what our life's about, man. It really is. It's about just, hey, every day's a new day. Every day's a new opportunity. 
it might be the day that everything you've all ever wanted changes. And otherwise, what's the point of living? If every day isn't just, maybe today's the day. Maybe today, I'm gonna show up because maybe today's the day. All these negative thoughts, whatever, I don't care. I'm still showing up. Maybe today's the day. And take those wins that you've had in the past and remember, oh wait, no, I've won before. I know what it feels like. I know I can win in, the, in other areas, so there's gotta be a chance for me here. And that, that mindset is just the key, I think, very important. And, and to keep that mindset, because we lose it, when you hear that negative thinking, think about what I just said. And the second part of that is, the other thing to keep that mindset is to get into scripture every day, every single morning, find a way, even if it's a quick verse, even if it's a daily devotion, if it's, I, I like to read a, 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 at least a chapter or a, um, yeah, a chapter. I like to read every single day in scripture because it always takes me back to what I know is true. And today, one of the things that, that the scripture that I actually pulled up from here was, uh, I think it was Matthew 17, 25, maybe. And it, it, it pretty much is saying uh, that deny yourself, pick up your cross and follow him. And that's just it. It's deny ourselves because your reward isn't in yourself. And it's what really makes things negative in our life. And we just focus on what our daily, what we need to do. To, I'm sorry. And we just focus on ourselves. If we're doing things just for ourselves, it gets really not fun. And that's where depression and all these other things come in. So pick up your cross, follow him, read your scripture every day, get in prayer, and remember that today is a different day. You have another opportunity. All these negative thoughts are only your life experiences. They don't mean anything. They're just what you've had in the past, and they're usually only your negative life experiences that your brain keeps on to. Our mind, our mind has a great way of staying on remembering pain. So it's really just the experiences where you got messed up, uh, met, where you messed up or where you failed or where somebody uh, denied you something or whatever it was. It's just your experiences. All you have to do is literally say, today's a new day. I don't care how much I don't want to do it because I don't want to feel that pain of failure again. I'm just going to keep showing up because one day I'm going to get out in that deer stand and there's going to be the biggest deer I've ever seen in my life and it's going to all be worth it. Hey, if you're not a hunter, I get it. That doesn't make sense to you. But Hopefully you can think about that as well. Hey guys, y'all have an awesome day. Hope this was helpful for you. And uh, yes, yeah, share it with people. Uh, hopefully it can be beneficial for them. And um, yeah, we'll continue to do the mindset on the drive time. Love you guys. Have an awesome day.